And uh, Katie, I can see that your boat safely arrived in Newport Harbor last night, so <laughs> Uh, you've got your accommodations yes. for the weekend and now and now I'm here it's it's been yeah it's been a good past couple days I mean we've had just a great yes. stretch of weather so even though it's been a little bit gloomy can't complain too much and we've steered clear of a lot of that rain that you're seeing behind us here well off to our east but we'll continue to see that chance for showers kind of increasing in likelihood throughout the day today here right now downtown Providence conditions staying dry our immediate area has as I mentioned steered clear of a lot of the heaviest of the precipitation in the last several hours, but not quite out of the woods just yet. Temperatures right now cool in the mid 60s, low to mid 60s across the area 65 in Providence up in Smithfield. We're at 63 and down towards the coast 65 as well in Narragansett and feeling a little bit more damp out there this morning as you're stepping out with those dew points still fairly elevated in the upper or the lower 60s, upper 50s at this hour, kind of leading way to a cooler, breezy and damp feel to the air throughout the day today. Those conditions are going to continue into Saturday as well. Your Sunday looks to be the better of the two days coming up here. Sunday, there is a slight chance for showers during the morning, but we'll see a partial clearing by the afternoon. But the rest of the day today and on Saturday, we are going to be tracking those chances for showers and lots of clouds throughout the area as well. Overall, the temperature trend over the next several days will be trending cooler below average. The average high is still approaching the mid 70s, so we'll be a few degrees below that over the next several days during the weekend and this upcoming work week. Satellite and radar here, this offshore stalled low pressure system is what's been kind of circulating, bringing those showers across our area. But as I mentioned, mainly out towards the Cape, they've been getting the brunt of those showers. But here locally, we will continue to see some chances, especially as we head towards the second half of the morning here in the afternoon. So let's take a look as we continue on. Showers will be inconsistent, kind of on and off. Not every location will see one. They'll be kind of scattered in nature throughout the day. With the drier second half of the day expected, lots of clouds around with those cooler temperatures overnight. But as I mentioned, the system will kind of stay stalled offshore and will continue to bring those chances for showers as we head on throughout the day Saturday as well. So with that, this morning, cool, damp, lots of clouds with those scattered showers throughout the morning this afternoon as well. The better chance will be towards the early afternoon and early evening. Second half of the day towards the late evening and then overnight does look a little bit drier, but we'll still be staying very cloudy with those chances for on and off showers kind of throughout the day today, overnight tonight and Saturday as well. As I mentioned, Sunday looking at the better day for this weekend, but we will be staying a lot cooler. So unfortunately this weekend not looking as good as what we've seen the past couple of weekends here, but not kind of a 50 50 weekend. Luckily, Sunday looking a little bit better. And as always, you can keep your updates anytime on our website, WPRI.com. We'll have those real time updates for when the rain is moving through over the